U.S. Army recently released video of what the battlefield can look like through the lenses of its new night vision goggles, and it is absolutely wild. Soldiers assigned to 4th Battalion, 23rd Infantry Regiment, 2nd Striker Brigade Combat Team, 7th Infantry Division conducted a platoon live fire exercise on April 19 at Joint Base Lewis McCord in Washington wearing the relatively new enhanced night vision goggles binocular. The Army first started fielding the ENVGB as a replacement for the older monocular PVS-14 night vision devices in fall 2019 at Fort Riley in Kansas. The view mode seen in the above video, which task and purpose first reported, is outline mode fused plus R, RTA, R standing for augmented reality and RTA standing for rapid target acquisition, Captain Daniel Matthews. A spokesman for 2nd Striker Brigade Combat Team, 7th Infantry Division, told Insider. The outline view is one of several settings available to ENVGB users. An Army video from last fall, for instance, showed the goggles lighting up the night as if it were the middle of the day. The ENVGB offers a larger field of view than traditional monocular goggles, moves away from the classic green glare and lets troops more easily see in the dark and through common battlefield obscurants like dust, fog, and smoke. The new goggles can also connect wirelessly to a soldier's rifle through the family of weapon sites individual for more accurate shooting and rapid target acquisition. With a picture-in-picture -picture setup, soldiers can simultaneously see what is in front of them and wherever their weapon is aiming. Not only can they shoot more effectively in general, but they can also shoot accurately from the hip or around corners. The Army has also experimented with connecting unmanned assets, like its pocket-sized Black Hornet drones, with the ENVGB so that the soldier can see what the drone sees in the display for significantly improved situational awareness. Captain Will Hess, commander of C Troop, 3rd Squadron, 89th Cavalry Regiment, 10th Mountain Division, said after a 2020 evaluation of the ENVGB system that in terms of target detection and clarity, the difference between the ENVGB and the PVS-14 is night and day. He revealed that the guys wearing the ENVGBs were taking targets out to 300 meters and even beyond, whereas our guys with 14s are having trouble seeing beyond 150. I can't say enough about the ENVGBs, Hess added. There's really no comparison. The next step for Army night vision technology is the integrated augmented reality system, an augmented reality system which has been in development for a little over two years. The futuristic Ivo's goggles feature digital thermal, night vision, and low light sensors with a 180 degree field of view. When the sensors are turned off using controls on the soldier's weapon, the soldier can see through the goggles without needing to move them out of the way a problem with more traditional designs. The IVIS headsets also give soldiers access to a wide range of digital tools, from mapping to tracking friendly and enemy forces on the battlefield. The Army has said that it plans to start fielding its new IVIS goggles later this year.